Recently, I cut my husband's hair for the first time in quarantine. I've had the opportunity to work for a sitting member of Congress, as well as a United States Senator. I have snowmobiled through the mountains of Colorado, snorkeled with wild dolphins in Hawaii, and whale watched on the waters of Alaska. And I've had the honor and privilege of meeting with two sitting presidents. I work for Iron Arts Technology as a computer scientist or software engineer, and I also am a contractor for the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. I began what I thought was going to be a career in radio broadcasting. Instead, I've spent my career working to improve the usability of broadcast, cable, and internet technologies by people with disabilities. And I'm the executive chef and owner of two restaurants in Houston, The Blind Goat and Sin Jiao. What I haven't done is let my vision loss keep me from pursuing my passions. My name is Brendan Mattingly. My name is Christine Ha, and I won MasterChef Season 3. My name is Eric Bridges, and I'm the Executive Director of the American Council of the Blind. My name is Carrie Farber, and I am the Director of Accessibility at Walmart eCommerce. I'm also a husband and a father, and I can't see. I am Tom Lekowski, and I am blind. I have a PhD in Computational Chemistry, and I am a blind person. I am also visually impaired. And I have retinitis pigmentosa. Congratulations to the graduating class of 2020. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Congratulations once again to all you seniors. For those of you that are gonna be going out into the world. My message for graduating seniors is be better today than you were yesterday. The only real limitations that you have are those that you place on yourself. One of the things I have learned along this journey is just how important it is to believe in yourself and how important it is to surround yourself with amazing mentors, family, friends, and colleagues who believe in you even more. We all stand on the shoulders of giants. Embrace the technology that exists today. As you begin your next chapter, be flexible. Take the time now to develop the skills and resources you'll need to pursue your unexpected opportunity. May your talents and passions fuel you forward into the next chapter of your journey. I can't wait to see what you and your class will accomplish. So get out there and get after it. Congratulations to all our 2020 graduates from the APH Connect Center. Visit us at aphconnectcenter.org.